There are a couple helpful helpful videos that I found um, on YouTube for setting it up uh, a PlayStation 3 controller to work with Guild Wars 2. Um, I've set up uh, my controller to, to work as the PlayStation 2 with pressure sensitive in Motion Enjoy. And then in X Pattern, um, the, there's a couple big things that, uh, that I like. Uh, the first is setting multiple actions on a single button. Um, so when you click on that and then click on Advanced, it'll bring up the Advanced Assignment options. Um, and you want to go ahead and uh, add a release zone and then your button and then another release zone and then a hold zone button and then a pause uh, the caveat there is that when you add the release zones and the hold zones they all uh, set as uh, one tenth of a second um, so the second ones you need to go ahead and change those to two tenths so this one's one tenth of a second right there and then you can see it's two tenths of a second right here and you can just change that right here <clears throat> but once you do that we click test test brings up a notepad and if you click the button quickly it'll do ones if you hold it it does fours so that's super useful so you can get more more actions you know per button <clears throat> I've set mine up uh, fairly simply uh, I, I have most of my actions right here on the these buttons and then I have my look around uh, along this uh, analog pad and what I did to do the look around was uh, was to set mouse look plus right click so that you know takes care of clicking I'd originally set the middle to be right click but it's just not it's kind of shitty to, to do it that way so once I set it this way, it was uh, it's, it's pretty comfortable to play. Um, and then I, I have my click in as a uh, left click. Um, the buttons over here. This is a uh, shift uh, shift plus tab to select last target. This is to select next target. T is for assist. Um, I set this up as a WASD, but that's uh, I mean, it's not very. Uh, it's not very good because it turns your character instead of strafing. So you want to go ahead and set the arrow keys and then W and S for back and forward. Then I'm just setting uh, on the triggers um, 6, 7, and 8. And then uh, my right bottom trigger is space and it also does 9. Um, I'm actually... I have 9 set on my X as well for the second, but it's a heal for me so it's not... Not a big deal. So, <clears throat> if you just want to see what it looks like, this is just using the controller completely. If you notice the the mouse doesn't really move around because it's uh doing that that select <clears throat> or that right click rather. So here's these. <clears throat> Triangle for this to block attacks. Then my X to do my third ability. Now it's uh it's pretty seamless this way. You might find that you like your button set slightly differently, but uh overall this has worked out pretty well for me. 